Last day of the con. I know, we get strapped in. Got my commissions that I did yesterday. You wanna so show them? I actually wanted commissions, so. This one was actually really cool. He wanted like the Spider-Man 300 pose with different characters, so I did Kiki. That's really cool. Kiki's livery service, yeah. And then Spider-Man. Um, so yeah, the last day of the con, are you excited? Yeah! All right, let's go. I feel bad for the babies though. I know, but we're gonna give them all the attention when we get back. Well, can you put on um, Bandit's favorite show? Yes. Oh shoot, we should film a lot. We did a really bad job of filming the first two. We? Days. Because we were. We, I got, I got film. Oh, I got film. I'm sorry, I was busy trying to sell books. <laughs> um, put on Bandit's favorite show, please. Okay. I thought it was right, a boy so this whole put time. On some dog TV and then get out of here. Should I put on Charmed for him? He does like Charmed. He does like Charmed, like his dad's. All right, we got everything. We're good. Yes. All right, let's go. Oh, like it's a beer. <sighs> This exclusive technology All right, bye, babies. agents to help mm -hmm. in real time by speaking mm -hmm. to He likes it at 14. Side to all of this Comic Con madness is that this happens every year, and then someone, I won't name any names, will get super upset because this is technically, technically, it's his office too. Most of the time, it's my office because you know, I'm shipping out comic, whether I'm shipping out comics or doing commissions, this is usually my office and, and Merlin's. Here's my little office mate. He likes laying in the trash with me too. You don't mind it, right Merlin? I feel like Merlin thrives in trash for some reason. I don't know if it's how he was raised or what, but I relate to him. Um, but yeah. Hi honey. Sorry, we'll make room for you. Here. Here, we'll make room for you. Please. Are you freaking? <laughs> what? What is this? Aaron, why? This is called my job. This. Why? Here. What are you? You're not doing anything. You're not making it better. I had a Kickstarter going. You know what happens when a Kickstarter goes? It goes. But how do you work? How do you? How do? You... How? Do you... What? what? I was trying to recap the whole LA Comic Con and tell them how it went and everything. How did you have, this is your first like Comic Con in like six years too. How did you, how did you fare? Hold on, I need something stronger than coffee. Love you. I love you. Ow! What? <laughs> What's up? No, I'm good. Uh, it was, it was good, it was really cool. It was, um, it was awesome. It was, we, did you tell them that we filmed like a whole bunch of material? And it just like, for some reason, the volume didn't capture? No, I'm gonna sue Apple after this. Remind me, remind me to sue Apple oh, after yeah, this. I'll get right on that. <laughs> uh, but um, yeah, no, it was it was a lot of fun. It was really cool. It was really cool to see like, I, like cause like the last time we did Comic Con was like what you said, like six, seven years ago. Yeah. And there was, I think you had one comic, maybe two comics. And so it was so crazy to see the, why you gotta eat a lollipop like that? 
This is how people ate That's lollipops. That's not what they do. Maybe, like, a little girl in the 50s eats a lollipop like that. You're a grown-ass man. So anyways, um, it was really cool to see the amount of inventory that you have. And, um, yeah, and that really has to do with the Kickstarters and you guys. Because, like, if it wasn't for you guys supporting those Kickstarters, we wouldn't have had that inventory to go to Comic-Con. A hundred percent. Seriously, over the years, with all the Kickstarters helping, we wouldn't have had nothing. It's really crazy out there in the public. I mean, the publishing world itself isn't, you know, the most profitable business, I'd say. <laughs> That's like, I knew that going into comics in the first place anyway, but it's fun. Just keep talking. Keep talking, keep talking. But it's fun. This is what I, you know, I'm an artist. I need to draw. You Just like you need to write, you need to write. I need to draw. I need to make a mess of things to make art. You know what I mean? That's just how I operate. I don't have to make a mess to write a book. You know what is a mess? In here, though. Well, All this is in here. That's an right organized here. mess. Look, look, what? Is this where we put the lollipop wrappers? I How do you... I need to keep some of these. I need to keep some of this for shipping. Like this? All this is for shipping. Like, I need that. This is like one week of my life because of the Kickstarter, and then it's gone, and then it'll be all pretty. But you don't clean it back it's to where it, <laughs> <laughs> to back where it needs to be. LA Comic Con was a success. It was like it was really nice to meet a bunch of fans and a bunch of um, just people that were into comics and things like that and art. I got a couple commissions. Like there was people that actually saw the art, like my art hanging, and wanted me to draw things for them. So that was fun. And um, we gained some more people that wanted to read our series, so that was a huge plus. Also, Reaper Cat, like, got a second win. That was really cool, because I always told Aaron, like, I don't know if you guys remember Reaper Cat. It was, it's a card game that Aaron designed that was, it's really fun. Like, even to this day, like, our nieces, our nephews, they always want to play it when they come over. <laughs> and even some of our friends will come over and they, like, will play. Um... But it got a second wind. Like, people were really interested in it. Oh, but it was so much fun. It was really cool. It was really cool. Thank you so much for everything that you did, too. Like, you being there and you helping. Like, I could seller. not... You know, I couldn't have done anything without you. You know that. I you know you. that you're the love of my life. And you're the, my rock. You're my big Italian rock. Can you rephrase that to something more cute? So, anyways... They, uh, yeah, it was really cool. So now we got, um, hopefully we'll be going to WonderCon, which is in Anaheim, um, California. In March. In March. March. And then, fingers crossed, but actually Aaron applied to go to Comic-Con in San Diego, the big, big one, in July. But that's juried. And I, I since I'm like a newbie again, I don't know, there's like a precedence there. It's kind of like politicky. Like I know Is that, it? I think it is because like, they jury everything. Everyone has to go through that selection process and then... You have to, they ask you how many years you've been doing it, and um, they want to make sure you're legit, I guess. So, I mean, hey, it's, hey baby, you're as real as they come. As real as these? Those aren't real. Oh, well. Implants! Oh, that's why, that's another reason I was saving some of this, so I can give you a little, because you're, there you go. Is it wrong that I be all right? <laughs> I couldn't even say it. <laughs> Anyways, I wish we'd gotten more footage of the event. It was a, it was a lot of craziness, and it was a it was a long three day weekend. So we really did, you know, we wanted to work and interact with everyone. And um, yeah, but uh, thank you guys so much for all your support over the years. This was really really fun, and I can't wait to do the next one. Yeah, and so. Um, Anyways, for also for the next vlog, we'll be starting to get ready for Italy. So I think the next one is leading up to, is the last vlog before we'll be uh, filming vlogs in Italy. So that should be cool. We're hoping to get at least two, maybe three vlogs in Italy. We'll see, fingers crossed, because we have a lot of things planned in there. We're on the final countdown right now. So next vlog, getting ready for Italy. Vlog after that, Italy. Yeah. Italy. Do you Italy. believe it? Oh my gosh. The most romantic city in the world, I know, it's Rome. Gonna be, it's gonna be so romantic. And even though it's our 11 year anniversary, we're celebrating our 10 year anniversary. Cause 10 year anniversary we were saving for this house. So, yeah, can you believe it? We'll, no. be in, we'll be in the great romantic city of Italy. We're going to the homeland. Oh my God, I can't wait. I, know. I can't wait. We'll see you guys soon. Hope you have a good rest of the week. Bye guys. Just no, 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 it's fine, it's fine. No, no, it's fine. no, no, it's, no, it's, fine. Not, fine. it's fine. not fine. It is not fine. <laughs> Thank you again for watching Husband and Husband. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of our stuff, you can join our Patreon where we do exclusive comics, videos, and a live stream every month. Also, you can find my book, 
and Aaron's Comics on our web store. Thank you guys for all of your support and we couldn't do this without all of your help. Thank you for being a part of the husband to husband family.